Hello and welcome to my channel. Please subscribe to my channel and turn notifications on so that you can get the notification about my new tutorials. Today we are going to look at another topic of Kaspersky which is basically how we can create a task and how we can run a virus scan on target machines. So to do that we will go to tasks over here and we can create task over here or I can specifically create a task under any specific group over here. Right. So rather than that I can come over here and I can create a task. And in this case of course uh, I have my plugin installed for 11.4 which is the version installed on my endpoint and I'll create a virus scan task. Now I need to define what exactly I would like to scan in that. Right, so I just keep it default. I'll say next and what action I would like to take if I find any threat over there I would like to disinfect and delete if disinfection fails disinfect and inform if disinfection fails only inform run disinfection immediately that actually requires reboot so that it can start and run for a the scan for even uh, programs are loaded to your memory if you want to do that of course you can do that also from here you can also define the scan should run when the computer is in idle mode but of course I'm not going to change these things for now I'm going to click on next now over here we need to specify the machines, the target machines where we are going to run the scan. For time being I am just going to click on this group so that whenever there is a new machine in this group it will automatically get this task assigned provided they are from version 11 or anything. It should not be the lower version which is not supported for this particular task. We we'll click next. If we need any specific credentials, we'll use that, otherwise we'll go with default. And then I can schedule this task to run daily, weekly, monthly, once, or manual or anything. Currently I'm going to probably schedule it as maybe weekly. And I can define the date and time period of it. And I can click on next and then I would just name it. After naming it, I have capability to run the task after the visit finishes if I want to trigger the task immediately. So I can do it this if I want to run it now. Of course for demonstration purpose we are going to run it now and we'll finish it. So if you see over here in results, it shows that task is modified and it is scheduled on this particular machine and because we said run is run immediately you see now the task has started running on this machine which you can see from here in the status of course as an admin you would not be going to end user machine but just in case if you want to verify you can see over here there are two tasks which are configured one is install updates which is completed and the other one is virus scan which is running. So this is how you can configure a virus scan task to be executed on the target machines. It can be on one machine or it can be on multiple machines. It's up to you. So it's just a quick way how you can configure a task to run a virus scan on schedule basis or maybe once. Up to you. And if you feel that this task is there and you want to trigger it, of course you have capability to right click on this task and start just in case of you feel the schedule is after some days but you would like to schedule it now or if you want to trigger it now you can do it. 
just as part of properties of this task meanwhile of course task is running we can have notifications we can have devices added over here we can tweak the schedule there are some other things which are very good like you can even do um, run the scan after the application is updated or maybe at application start or maybe when the new updates are downloaded to the repository and there is something called on virus outbreak that's something we can discuss in detail but I'm not going to cover it now but yes these are some things which can be done in terms of the schedule of the task in the options you can of course set the level of the scan additional areas um, and some more details over here you can put the scope again you can change if you want that's also possible and same if you want to change the count and that's it it will have all the revisions if you are amending anything on this task so this this is all about the virus scan task of course this task as yes, we have done a full scan would take quite long so my only purpose to show you how you can configure the Kaspersky virus scan task and how you can trigger it to the target machines Thank you so much for watching this walkthrough. Please use the comment section below to let me know if this solves your problem or this is what you were looking for and to discuss more about any of the technologies which I'm talking about. Thank you and stay blessed.